Hey, it's Janity Johnson. It's been a while since I have done a Facebook Live, and honestly, this is just very impromptu. I'm just jumping on. Uh, I just found a quick little uh, website. I didn't even realize that we could use this. Um, I don't see a lot of people doing it, but I think it would make a lot of sense to stand out with your ads during the uh, holiday season and with all the marketing out there, there's a lot of competition with the ads. So I highly suggest um, maybe testing this out. So what I want to show you today is how you can use bold in your ads, how you can use um, italics, how you can use the blocks, and lots of different things. We've always been hand tied, like we can't underline, we can't bold. All we can do is capitalize with Facebook ads. And I do want to show you uh, real quick this um, site I found, and it, I've tested it, it does work. Uh, real quick, I want to pull up an ad account to my test ad account before I share my screen. So while I'm doing that, if you are on here, I have no idea how many people will see it. I just jumped on. Uh, but if you want to introduce yourself or just put in the uh, below it, what your business is, who you are, I would love to see that, where you're from. I always like to see the country you're from. Let me just go down to my testing one. And then I will give you the name of website. This is pretty cool. Um, let's just go in here. And I'm going to pretend I'm editing an ad. All right. Now I'm going to come back to you and edit. All right. So here we are. And I will share this screen too to broadcast. And then I will remove myself. So we will just show that screen and now we will go over to the web so this is just a test test ad and under ads you can see where you put where it says text with emojis here is text with emojis so that's where we're going to test it so the the website is called yaytext.com y a y text.com so yay text.com at the top what you need to do let me get rid of that ad maybe i can maybe i can't no i can't so okay so at the top you want to put in your text so what do we want to say click my ad <laughs> not that you'll put that so we're going to put click my ad and let's try this bubble text let's see if that works copy paste and we and as you can see right over here on that side I don't know if my screen's that big now I'm at hundred percent so here it says click my ad now that one's kind of hard to read so let's try a different one let's do this one of the black squares you might have seen in this post let's do they have different fonts let's do the bold copy go to the ad and Paste. Boom. It's actually bolted. That is bold because if you look down and you put in by now, you can see the difference. So, quite a bit of difference from that. Uh, you could do italics. You can do um, this is fun. So, let's go find one that maybe looks like fun. Some, I know that sometimes some do work, some don't work. Um, let's try this double one copy. This is fun. And there it's double. So as you can see, you can do some of this to in this is in the text area. I actually haven't tested. So let's do that together. Want to see if anybody jumped on. Okay. Uh, let's do this together. And let's go down to this area where it says take action so we're going to go back here and do oh i might have gone too far let's just do there's a bold take action copy i have no idea if this is going to work or not it did voila 
And then let's go back here. Now, obviously, this is way too many fonts. I highly suggest you not use this many fonts. Do not use that many fonts. <laughs> but um, find a couple that you like, maybe an italics and a bold, and that's it, so that it's not too crazy. And then we want um, news feed description. So that's what we're looking at. And then that could be potentially something different. Let's try this bubble text. And there it is. It's really, really hard to read. So remember that I wouldn't use it, but just FYI, that does seem to work. So if you actually preview this ad, then you can change out those different fonts. All right, I'm going to come back to you. And that is it. So it's called Yay Text, Y A Y T E X T dot com. And go test it out. Test it out with your ads. You can also test it out with your posts themselves. I actually put it into Be Live. I never saw if, um, let's go make sure that here I can kind of share my screen again. Let's see. Solo. So let's see if we can go back to my page and we'll call go look at the live. It's moving a little slow because it's battling things. Who is it moving slow? All right, it took a while, sorry about that. Get rid of that. Ah, I have too many things popping up. I don't want that on my screen. Go away, please, there it is. Okay, I just wanna see that it did work. Where's my thing? Here it is. So as you can see, this is how I set this up. How to add bold and italics to Facebook ads. Yeah, <laughs> and so I should've done yay, Y-A-Y. -Y because that's what it is. And Bonnie, thank you, Bonnie. She put that into the comments below. So I appreciate that. Bonnie, definitely check it out. But as you can see, this is an example of how it looks on a post itself. Don't go too crazy with it. I mean, you know, we don't want to stand out that much and be annoying and obnoxious. But I think it's cool to do it to a certain extent. So here I will come back and thank you guys for joining me. Take action with this. And then as always, I always like to hear if you do take action with what I've taught, definitely um, message me on Facebook, Instagram, or any place like that. And just let me know your successes. Thanks. Have a good one.